What up, people? This is Vigilante. I have a conflicted feeling about NWA making it to the 2016 Hall of Fame. One side of me said, yes, they deserve to be there. They deserve to be there, especially over cheap trick, as far as I'm concerned. The other side tells me, damn. Does NWA deserve to be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame? And you think about it. Maybe yes. Two albums. The impact of Cube and the people that the branches that fell off the tree of NWA. Maybe. But my point is, how in the hell LL Cool J doesn't make it in the Hall of Fame, but NWA does. That would be my only beef. That would be my only beef. It's because if NWA make it, then Outkast, which is one of my favorite groups, I know they're going to make it, right? What about Tribe Called Quest? Are they going to make it? Wu-Tang? Are they going to make it? Or can the impact of movies and at the right time open up the door? Because as a black man, as an uh, artist myself, I salute them. I salute NWA for getting in. No hate. But the other side of me go, huh, maybe this could be a good thing. Because it is a good thing. Let me take that back. It is a good thing. I'm glad to end. But I'm conflicted because of the other people that didn't get in. And if you go by music, the impact of F the Police and what NWA did, it can give a good case. Long body of work. Nah, Cube is on one album. Then they don't have Cube on the second album, which did pretty good on the charts. Niggas for Life album. Uh, I don't know, y'all. Tell me what you think. I'm going to trip it. I'm not being a hater because I am I said I'm glad they made it. I'm just conflicted by the other people that did make it. That's in hip-hop. But it's a good thing overall for hip-hop. It's great. It is great. We still need our Rap Hall of Fame, y'all. We still need our own Rap Hall of Fame. We need that. But. They did it. I salute them. And I don't understand why the legend in leather, Prince of Rap, is not in the Hall of Fame. But salute NWA. Out.